G'day all, Taz Daz here again and welcome to my latest video and thanks for stopping by. Today I'm doing a semi new product, it's been around for a few months now, but we've got um, Dr. Octors and his Papa Giuseppe branded pizza pies, two pack mega meaty. So if you can see the picture there, they're like a little pie with pizza toppings on the inside. Um, I'll put the ingredients and the nutrition up on the screen like I normally do. Um, 20, 22 to 24 minutes in the oven for these suckers. So there's two pies in here obviously. So let's have a look at them. Then we'll pop them in the oven and uh, see how they turn out and see what they taste like. Oh, oh there was, there's one there. So they're individually wrapped. All right. So let's open it up, get it out of the uh, the plastic, so we can have a, a better look at it. Alright, so it looks like we've got little bits of pepperoni, ham, cheese, so there it is there. So you can see all the little meats on there and it is in like a little like pie shape. There, close up of all the, the meats and cheese. So there's two of them, so I'm gonna get them in the oven and then I'll be right back and we'll give them a try. All right, so we're back and we've got our cooked pizza pie. It's been in there for a bit over 20 minutes and this is how it's turned out. So that looked pretty decent to me. Um, there's the bit of a idea of the size of it. So a bit bigger than a, a normal meat pie. Smells really good. So definitely getting the, the smell of the pepperoni and that on it. Um, yeah, another close up there just to show you, but look, pretty well packed with the meat and the cheese. The, the pie is a bit crispy. All right, let's cut it down the middle and have a look. So there we go. So there's our cross section. So you can see you've got your base there, which is reasonably thick, and then you've got some nice gooey cheese and all the toppings. Oh, it smells really good. It smells a lot like a meat lover's pizza and that's got to be good um, all right so I think it's gonna be hot but we'll give it a bit of a taste anyway so let's go on the side here okay so in that bite I got the crust which is actually quite a nice flavor on the crust. If you've ever had um, a Dr. Octa's pizza before, you'll know the flavor of the crust, it's the same. Nice, sweetish, but rich tomato sauce. I don't know where the meat is. You can see it on there, but couldn't really taste it. So what we're going to do is we're going to get some of the meat there, if you can see that up close. Then let's try it on its own. A little bit of porkiness in the, in the meat, so there is some kind of meat flavour there. but. Honestly, if I scrape all the topping over here, like that, you're not getting a huge amount of topping compared to the base. Um, which I guess is to be expected. It is a frozen pizza after all. So let's try that big piece right there. Mm. 
So after scraping all the topping onto that one little corner there, the flavour was really nice. So the issue with this is there's not enough topping. The base is too thick um, compared to the amount of topping on it as well. So pretty much when you take a bite as it is, like how it is there, you're really only getting the tomato sauce and the crust. Not much meat flavour, you can't really taste the cheese. So a little bit disappointing. They're all right. They're um, they're about six dollars fifty though, or something like that, for two pies, which is a little bit expensive. So I'd really only recommend trying them if they're on special. You can normally get them for about four or four dollars fifty on special. So based on the full price for value, five out of ten. For flavour, as they are out of the box. Uh, give them five and a half out of ten and for flavor with all the topping on one little corner of the pizza I'd give it eight out of eight yeah eight out of ten if it had a lot more topping it would have been really good okay so that'll be it for this review of Papa Giuseppe's by Dr. Octa mega meaty that isn't mega meaty pizza pies if you like the review, please give me a thumbs up. Please subscribe, hit that notification bell so you'll be notified whenever I upload a new video. Uh, thanks for watching and hopefully I'll see you on the next video. Bye.